Okay. Hello, what on YouTube? So, today I'm going to go ahead and do my Arkansas Razorback season prediction. Uh, with spring game being canceled due to the coronavirus, I figured I might as well go ahead and do it. <clears throat> so, of course, this being if we had the season, but I'll get into that. I'll break into so, starting out week one at home against Nevada. I think we'll get the win in that game, 35-21. But then the next week, go on the road to Notre Dame. I think we're going to lose that game, 42-28. Uh, apologies. Dog. She wants out of the pen. She can't get out of the pen. Because she hasn't been fixed yet. We have two male dogs, so. Uh, but we're going to lose to Notre Dame, I think, 42-28. Week three, we go to Mississippi State. I think we lose that one, 38-21. I know. Both teams have new coaching staffs all the way through. Mississippi State's is the most recent change, and that we could win that game, I think. That's a toss-up, but right, I predict that we're going to lose because they got to mesh with each other, and not having spring ball is going to hurt more than, than people realize. I think it's going to take us a while to get on track. Um, the next week, we're in Arlington in Cowboy Stadium. Against Texas A&M, I think we lose that game by a field goal, 35-31. That's always a close game, no matter how bad we are. So, again, apologize for the dog. But I think we lose again, 35-31. Next game, we're at home against Charleston Southern. I think we win that game, 42-14. Then we are at home again against Alabama. I think we lose to Alabama, 63-35. Uh, the next game we're at home against LSU in the battle for the Golden Boot. Early, early this year. I don't know why, but it is. We lose that 35-21. The next week we're at home against Tennessee. That's homecoming again. That's a game that I could see us winning, and we're going to start getting back to where you know getting to where we're competing but i do think we lose that one by touchdown 28 24 uh, 28 21 28 24 is a field goal game 28 21 <clears throat> then we go on the road to auburn play against coach morris and you know i think we lose that 42 35 trust me no more i would love for us to beat coach morris that's it then we get old miss of course again their new coach lane giffen I could see this as a win. I really could, but I just don't know. I think Ole Miss is going to get a field goal on us at the end of the game and beat us 24-21. But, again, that's one that we could win. I could see us winning possibly, possibly six games, but I don't think it's going to happen. Then, oh, by the way, Ole Miss is at home in, in Fayetteville. We then get Louisiana Monroe. At home, last time we played ULM was in Little Rock and we got beat. I don't think we're going to get beat this time. 56-31. We're getting on, getting together. They're figuring each other out by now. They're ready to go. Then, of course, the final game of the season is in Arrowhead Stadium in Kansas City against Missouri. Again, they have a new coach as well. And a lot of drinkables. Yeah, I wouldn't have minded having it at Arkansas, but I'm happy with Coach Pittman. I've already said that in my... Uh, Depending on his hire video, but uh, this one we're on track. We're we've meshed well, and I think we'll beat Missouri 35 to 31. I I feel confident about us beating a lot of Drinkwitz's Missouri Tigers more than I do Mike Leach's Mississippi State Bulldogs and Lane Kiffin's Ole Miss Rebels. In the long run, Lane Kiffin is not going to work out for Ole Miss, I don't think. Now, Mike Leach, I, that might be a pretty good hire for Mississippi State. So, final record, 4-8. and eight. Finish 4-8 and eight on the season. I mean, not bad for a guy in his first year coaching Power 5 football. And new staff, you know, pretty good record. It's better than what a lot of people think are going to happen, probably. 4-8 and eight is what I think. But I could easily see it's going six and six. It all depends on how the team works. Prediction for a starting quarterback, Felipe Franks. Felipe Franks is going to start. I, I think Felipe is going to be the starter because 
he's the most experienced. So, Felipe's going to start. How's that? Um, so, yeah, that's what I, my prediction, but, um, hopefully, we'll have a season. It's kind of up in the air right now with coronavirus. They've got, uh, I think it was June or July, I think they have to have practice, or they can't do football, but, uh, as long as they get to practice in, by June or July, I think it is, whenever the summer practices and stuff like that, fall camp or whatever, uh, starts, then they can, then we can have a season, so it just depends on that with the, everything that's going on with the virus and stuff, you know, you just, uncertain times, but, uh, all we can do is just pray that we have a season, uh, you know, in fact, I'll lead a prayer right now, if that's okay with you guys, if you don't want to, to do that part, then whatever, but, uh, Dear Lord, we come to you to ask that you will uh, allow the, you, you, you uh, push the coronavirus aside, get it out of here, kill it, so football season can start up. I, I realize that football may not be that important. It, it's really not. But it's big for us here in America, in, in, for America and in Arkansas, and we'd really like to have a season. Um, so if you would kill out the coronavirus in time for football, that would be wonderful. But not my will, but thy will be done. Whatever you want done, Lord, is what we'll do. But if you would please let us have a season, we would very much appreciate it and would be ever thankful. And thank you for keeping your protecting hand on our country through these trying times. Jesus, holy name, we pray, amen. So, um, Lord willing, we have a season. Um, I just thought it'd be good to lead a prayer. But just keep praying about this whole ordeal. Keep praying about the season. And Lord willing, we get to see some football in the fall. Until the next video. Oh, that reminds me. Him Sing Series temporarily postponed. So it's kind of like NBA season. It's right now. It's not canceled. It's just postponed until further notice because I just don't have time right now to do that. And with this whole thing going on, going on, I haven't been able to get any videos up. I just barely had enough time to do this one. So I thought I'm gonna do this this video because it's one of my most popular things for the year every year so I figured I'm gonna go ahead and do this and go with it but him sing series I intend to get back to that as soon as I can but right now it's just not happening I just do not have the time for, with all this so but as far as that I'll get to it as soon as I possibly can but this one like I said one of my most popular series video that I do every year. It's one of the most popular things that I do. So I thought I'd better go ahead and do this. Um, as far as do I think we're going to have a season? I don't know yet, but I feel confident. And I trust that the Lord's going to work out what we need to happen. What he thinks needs to happen, he'll work it out. So, But um, until the next video, whenever that may be, we'll pig and God bless.